Yo, what's up, man? It's your boy Malik S, and I'm back for another episode of Nobody Asked Me. Nobody asked me. As usual, I got my team with me, Keisha E, over here snacking, not Keisha professional. E eating. Hey and I got my guy Hess Wesley. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? As you can see, Keisha, we gonna leave that in. We ain't gonna edit that out. Yeah. I'm hungry. On camera. I'm not that girl. You Why you eating with your mouth open right now? Why are you eating with your mouth open? Why are you eating with your mouth? So you eat on the first date? You going in? Steak, potatoes, Absolutely. everything. To, you eat, right? I mean, but it's the first day, though. Like I don't eat. Because you're supposed to be cute. Like, nah, I'm good. Uh-huh, right. <laughs> <laughs> Order a small man. little thing. No, get, no, no. get the fries. Okay. That's it. Well, Keisha let you <laughs> know. I like a grown man. She eat on the first let me date. Let you know that now. So second day, you buffet in her ass. <laughs> right. <in> buffets. <laughs> Do you cook, Keisha? Mm-hmm. I cook every day. That's the, that's the, um, the number one thing for me that I look for in a woman. Can you cook? Mm-hmm. You know what I... My, that, my, my mom was a chef. With that being said, yeah, that goes right into what I want to ask y'all. What's up? Cooking. What? what happened to grandmas? Mm. Mm. What happened to grandmas, man? <laughs> yeah. They don't have grandmas like I had. Mm. I had a real grandma. Mm. Apron, clean, <laughs> <Right>. cook, <laughs> always home. Uh-huh. <laughs> Dinner cooked by 7 in the morning. Yeah. Dinner is done. Grandmas ain't home no more. No, these yeah. niggas ain't. They, they gambling. Have, they got Facebook. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Definitely on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? That's why. I th- think it was when the names changed. And if you're in Miami, you over there at the Hard Rock. Yeah. Gambling. You be like, hey, Grandma, uh, can you watch my kid? I'm going to this show. She like, shit, I'm going to. <laughs> I'm going to. How you know about it? <laughs> right. It was yeah. on the Facebook. Right. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I got DM'd about it. That's, that's why hilarious. I think That's why I think the black community, community is going down. <laughs> ain't no more grandmas. Ain't nobody praying for us. Hey, People, hey, see, I think ain't no more grandmas. When, when the names change, like my grandma is like Flora May, Lily May, yeah. you know what I mean? When your well, grandma's grandma, name now, Sheila, Rosa and May, yeah, Erica. So, so it's a different vibe. Like, your grandma ain't supposed to name Erica still Erica? in the streets. Yeah. Like, your grandma ain't supposed to be named Erica. What, what happens when I'm somebody's grandma? <laughs> <laughs> first of all, Grandma you, Keisha. First of all, you ain't supposed to know your grandma's real name. Right, yeah. That's, you're supposed to call her Nana yeah, or something. That's a real grandma. You don't no, even know grandma's real name. That's the problem in the black community people don't know people's real name. <laughs> but a grandma, you ain't part of no grandma's real name. Because right, I yeah. think it takes away from the grandma. You can't call her that, but you should know it. But if you know, like, What's grandma. What's man man name? Damn, what is man man But that's man? different. Know, that's your cousin. I ain't counting on man man prayers. <laughs> All oh, right, or yeah. his sweet potato pie. I don't even know your grandma's name now. No, I don't think you both know because grandma's like grandma. But also, they a you lot find of them. out grandma name Takesha. Like what? <laughs> grandma Takesha. That kind of take away from grandma, dog. Grandma got a real name. I don't want no respect. apple pie from Takesha. My, my grandkids better put some respect on my name. You hear me? I just I your granny was hot back in her day. Yeah, yeah. Uh, grandma had an apron on all day. Yeah, yeah. 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 And she used to, you could drop the kids off anytime. Yeah. But I think, but times have changed because also our grandmas, a lot of them, they didn't work. Yeah, that's true. You know what I'm saying? Nah, grandma going to work. So yeah. she need to, she need to hit happy hour afterwards because yeah, she had a long week. It do be a lot of grandmas at Walmart checking you, you know, out. You know, growing up, I, I, ne- I didn't have, I mean, I didn't have my grandma. My grandma passed when I was two years old. But, but, but a lot of my friends had grandmas. So I was always at my friend's houses. Cause of their grandma, right. she would oh, she would be the one that give you some change before you go to school. She would give you some candy. Mm-hmm. She give some, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like there's that. I know what a grandma is, even yeah. though my my grandma died when she. I mean, when I was two years old. But like, I get it. There nowadays, you know who these kids go to? They don't even. They just go to on social media. They don't go to grandma for nothing. These kids watch themselves. Ain't no, ain't no more. <laughs> exactly. They, they watch themselves. Grandma, candy lady. Right, a exactly. Candy lady. Exactly. Yep. She had the frozen. Nobody she had the frozen cups. Candy lady. candy lady was grandma. <laughs> she had the frozen candy cups. Lady Amazon. Amazon. Hot sausages. Amazon <laughs> happens to the candy lady. Ain't no more candy that. lady, dog. <laughs> Mok. You go to candy lady house, get a quarterback chip, <laughs> yeah, yeah. get a frozen cup. Now, ladies. <laughs> I never mess with a candy lady, though. You ain't had no candy lady? Oh, we man, probably had one on our no neighborhood, but I'm not going to your house. Candy house lady house. Side. Candy what? lady was lit. She had, she had the big king size Snickers. Also, I didn't eat a lot of candy growing up. But she person. sold chips and, and and pickles and hot sauce. Hot sauce. See, we from Miami. You yeah. Yeah. Pickle eggs. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, I ain't eat that. I ain't pickle eat that because yeah. I, 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 I thought that was girl that food. That was nasty. Yeah. That was girl food. It was food. pink. Yeah, the pink. Yeah. Yeah, pink the hot color. sausage yeah. was like girl food. The pickle was eat. pink? No, no, the eggs were they pink. They just put the egg in like... Like, like a boiled egg? Yeah, it's it was, a boiled yeah, egg. And pickle? Yeah, and pickle juice. That's a pregnant yeah. snack. That's yeah. like a whole... Yeah, that's why I say it was girl snack. Yeah. <laughs> you, was a, you couldn't be no boy eating no hot sausage. Because <laughs> a hot sausage is coming like a little fake Ziploc bag. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And some people was like, put some juice in it. 
and then they drank the juice. <laughs> Yeah. Juice? Florida, yeah, yeah, yeah they yeah. drink because like it used to come like a little zip, my bad, and they just that squeeze the a, yeah. Oh that my is gosh, country. they used yeah. to sell the pig feet too. Pig feet, pig yeah. feet. The, the candy pickle, lady, the candy pickle lady pickle pickle sold feet. pig feet. The yeah. pickle feet, pickle pig feet, yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. In mm-hmm. a jar, you see all of. I'm, like, let me I, get two nine letters and some pig feet. What? Just like that, yeah. Or in a hot sausage. Mm-hmm. Yep. Wow. Yeah. Candy laid out. Which she uh, was, was a grandma. Wow. Yep. Who was AKA somebody grandma. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I and think... nobody robbed Candy can- Lady. Because everybody got her back. Everybody had her Everybody respect. loved her. And that's the problem, but, too. But also, it's not as many kids. Like, my grandma, it's like maybe 50 of us on my dad's side, like 60 of us on my grandma's side. Like, that was kind of the thing. Now, grandma's. You got one kid, two kids. People not having that many kids no more. So wow. I think yeah. the whole image of what that is kind of changed. You know? I miss grandmas, man. You know, it used to yeah. be good old grandma. Because, like, like I say, like, people used to have, back then, there was respect and honor. Even mm-hmm. with, with thugs and the, and the bad dudes in the neighborhood, right, right. they knew certain homes yeah. you just didn't touch. Right, exactly. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now it's like, it's fair game. Yeah. Because I yeah. think ain't no more grandmas. Right. You know, ain't no more grandmas be like, young man. Right. Put that gun down. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> Not grandma like shit, dude. You got to right. do that. Right. Do what you about, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> grandma about that lot. Hey, don't get caught, nigga. Right. You know what I'm saying? You no know what I realized, too? <laughs> like, you ain't never seen... I remember when I was a kid, my dad used to be mad. Sometimes I would want to cook. I was never really, like, super girly under my mama or whatever, but sometimes I would want to just cook. And my thing was tacos, right? Because mm-hmm. I was a kid, tacos and brownies. And my daddy would be hot, like, tacos, that ain't no dinner, that ain't no, right? Right. You ain't never get a man. <laughs> I cook everything, guys. I make peach copper from scratch. Um, okay. But you think about it, like, you ain't never, your grandma wasn't making no damn tacos. Like, you never, nah. even the stuff that people make these days. Grandma made real food. It's like, yeah, scratch. Right. Everything was from scratch. Everything was a meal. Some grandma made clothes from scratch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but, I, I'm old school like that though. Donald talk about me because one day he hit me like, "Yo, we about to go bowling." I was like, "I just put my greens on my ham hocks." He was like, "What is <laughs> <it>? ham hocks?" <laughs> yeah. He was like, "It's, it's Tuesday." I'm right. like, "Nigga, you don't eat on Tuesday." <laughs> I eat on Tuesday. Who cook ham hocks for one? <laughs> right, exactly. In your in your stream beans, you got to get that real flavor. You got to get that real flavor. God damn, Keisha, <laughs> ham hocks for one? That's that's a big meal. That's well, a let's, family let's, meal. Let's make it. And then also have my sides. I think I might have made some mac and cheese that day and damn cornbread whatever. on a Tuesday. Like, do you not eat on Tuesday? Not like that. Like that. <laughs> damn, I don't have a. You day cooking for the week though? Like on that Tuesday, you cooking nah, for Tuesday, Wednesday, was, Thursday? That, nah, that was for, that was for that Tuesday night. meal. <laughs> I mean, I would have leftovers for like Wednesday because it's only me. But, right, right. But no, that was just for that. You know that day. That was just, it was just a Tuesday. Damn. It was just Tuesday. She had to put them out the but night before. That's how the women in my family. My mama every day we had a home cooked meal. Even I grew up like you know what I mean. You had a home from scratch. I remember I got to college. And my friends geek me up talking about some hamburger helper. I'm like, what's that? And they're like, you ain't never had no hamburger helper. I'm like, no. As soon as they pulled out that box, I was like, I don't do, I don't do box. You don't do box <laughs> food. <laughs> like yeah. my, my mom cooked from scratch every day. My aunties, yeah. my grandmas, I, you know what I'm saying? That's what I grew up watching. So growing it's like, up, I always had a hot meal every day when I came home from school. Yeah. And you know we yeah. Haitian. Uh-huh. You know, it's, it's, it's always there. Some rice. And by the way, yeah. <laughs> yo, see, see, and I had this issue too with people that are dead dick, because they were always they would always like expect me to like make a decision on what we want to eat. And you know, women don't like to make decisions on what right. they want to eat. And I they would, would, I would go be to very me. Clear to you on what I want to eat. And they'll go to me like, <laughs> what's I don't know what I'm like, I don't know because what growing up, yeah, whatever was on the table, yeah. that's what I ate. Yeah. I don't care what it was, my mom cooked. <laughs> yeah. If you ain't eat that, you ain't eat. You ain't eat. <laughs> and it. you had to finish it. And you, you, had to you couldn't move. To you. I'm exactly. like, man, I'm full. Like, you better you finish, no that, finish that damn either. plate. Like, God damn, I'm full. <laughs> right. They made sure your ass ate. You sitting at the table till you get a little more hungry. <laughs> <laughs> See, Five I get, more hours. I get hungry. <laughs> right. The food don't get cold. Like, got to eat it now. I got school tomorrow. Like, God damn. You better finish that you plate, boy. You that food. <laughs> Dude, these kids don't even know how hard it is. You know? I know. Yeah. They get to go and they get to choose. I want this and I want that instead. I don't want nah, bro. Yeah. That's what my friend. I saw her Insta story. She made four different meals. It's her, her husband, two kids. What? She's like he yeah. want this, they want that. She want this, she don't eat this. I mean, see, yeah, I was nah, like, you a good yeah, one. Nah. That's crazy. You good my mom yeah, cooks no. every day, but you best believe she cook me, one meal. You gonna eat? <laughs> right. In, 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 a, in a growing up when I was young, and also in, in island culture, you right. eat whatever the father wants. Right, exactly. Mm. Even if you allergic, yeah, hey nigga, <laughs> we eating fish today. I'm allergic. Well, I guess you ain't eating. That's what your daddy wanted. Right, exactly. 
you gonna Luckily, eat whatever. I think we all kind of like the same food. So yeah. in my house, dude, you gonna, yeah. I mean, you. That's why you noticed back in the day, kids ain't had no allergies. You ain't had no allergies, did nah. you? <laughs> Your only allergy was hunger. Oh, <laughs> now these kids, I can't eat this, I can't eat that. Like, yeah. nigga, I ain't had no allergies growing up. <laughs> right. I was going to starve. Everything. Right, yeah. I'm allergic to shellfish. Uh, all right, then, <laughs> guess you'll eat tomorrow. You'll be all right. right. That's like, mama, they ain't going to kill you. That was my mama. Yeah, they, they ain't going to kill you. you. Right. They ain't going to kill you, boy. But what if it do, though? Like, if what you, if tomorrow but it ain't, I wake but it, up dead? What but you it ain't. You ain't going to know. If you weren't allergic, you ain't going to be allergic tomorrow because you done already ate it and passed through your body. Your body got used to it, and now you good. These soft. I do feel like I was about to say kids are so much they're, they're soft these soft days. as shit yeah mm -hmm. soft as shit like yeah. my kids are soft as hell privilege <laughs> soft mm -hmm. like That's you your say, fault like like my kids mom literally would oh well she don't like this like what. <laughs> she don't work nowhere. <laughs> Look at me, she don't. Right. When you get a job, that's when you can say what you don't like. like. Yeah. She don't work no goddamn the way. The parents are soft. That's why. She's uh -huh. soft. I got homegirls. Why your six year old got an iPhone 12? For, no, she can't have my phone number because she's not about to FaceTime me to death all day <laughs> about nothing. Why she got a phone? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. My daughter what had a phone. What is she ever not with was, an adult? My daughter was like eight. She had a phone. Wow. Nigga, that's your phone. No, dude. six. My, Playing on YouTube. Eight or six. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah You'd be yeah, like, yeah. why you got a phone? Well, she asked for it. So you couldn't say no? <laughs> You got to yeah. tell your kids no sometimes. Yeah, I tell your kids no. I remember growing up, it was times I was asking stuff, and I'm like, I know we have the money for it. My parents would be like, no. And then I got older, and I got it. Like, sometimes you just got to say no. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, you ain't just got to say no. It should be you something behind it. You can't give your kids it. everything. No, but I'm saying, should, that's what I'm saying. For. It should be a lesson behind why you're saying yeah. no. You know, mm -hmm. like, even when my daughter, when I put it this way, when my daughter was younger, I used to always give her everything. Now that she's 12, going on 13, now it's like, I don't give her everything. Now I make her earn certain things. Like, because now she's great, like good grades. Yeah, because now, mm. now she's old enough to know, like, hey, I, you don't just get everything. Right. I'm going to mm -hmm. give you everything you need. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But all the stuff you want, I don't know. You're going to have to start earning some shit now. Like, like I can't, doing chores or. Yeah, you can't oh, just be like just getting stuff. Or if she get allowance, I'll be like, well, if you want that bad, then save your money. Let's see how bad never, you I really want. I allowance it. growing up. It was just like, yeah. I asked for something. And she you, get but, that but, it was, but sometimes they would say no because it's right. like you don't. I just bought you gym shoes last week and the week before that. You know right. what I mean? So sometimes they would say no, but I didn't really get. She it got a like set amount. Of she got a little debit card. Like it's like a little. Debit How old card. is she? She's twelve. It's a green what card. A, what it's a debit kids. card! It's, it's four kids, so her allowance gets deposited into that, mm. so she could learn, start learning how to you know do use money, yeah. with yeah. money. Yeah. And so when she wants certain things, I'd be like, well, hey, you gonna have to wait. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you want it that bad. What's your daughter yeah. name? Some more. Some more. DM yeah. me when you watch this. I'm going to yeah. give you all the tips on how you get anything you want from your oh, dad. Oh, no. She already You never did. accept no from your no, dad. Your she, mama, sometimes you take the L. Your yeah, dad? She got an allowance. You give what? her a certain amount of money every week or something she like did. that? Well, I'm going to be honest with you. I, her mom gives her a certain allowance, you know, by way of me, of course. Yeah. <laughs> and your parents are together. You, you know, definitely could yeah. be milking your daddy. What? Oh, no. She milks. <laughs> she milks. Listen. <laughs> She milks. I don't know. I don't know. I don't she know got that. a whole section in here. So when you say like, that's hilarious. Yeah, she she milks. You know what I mean. But I because she's a little older now, I have to start letting her know. Like, hey, she don't go to grandma. Nah, she don't need to. She go to me. Yeah. Because she, you know, I, I just want her to know. Like, it's not. This is just me. This is not life. That's what I yeah. want to understand. Like, yeah. this is just me always. It's not like but things see, are always going to be happening like this for you. That's an advantage, too, of these new grandmas. Because I never went to my grandma. But my grandma got, like, 50 grandkids. Like, you right. know what I mean? But right. So that's the difference, too. Like, But her grandma, grandma gave her stuff. Her grandma grandkids. gave her stuff. But most of the stuff is always by way of me because it's my kid. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So I always try to make sure she don't really need anything. You uh -huh. know what I'm saying? But her wants, like, right after Christmas, she won the iPad. Like, God damn. Then she hit me with the, oh, well, you know, I be on Zoom and it's easier for me to take my notes and da 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 <laughs> da. Damn. And you and was then, like, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, all right. All right. All right. You want those Zoom in? <laughs> I be on Zoom, it's easier to take notes. Yeah, damn. Yeah, like, yeah. She, so she hit me with that bullshit. <laughs> but really, she playing Roblox. <laughs> <laughs> that part. But she hit me with the education part of it. <laughs> right, yeah. So she gets no. smart. She gets <laughs> yeah, smart. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm going to throw this Zoom on this nigga. Yeah. He ain't going to say no to that. Yeah. So my it's dumb ass when I got an iPad. Yeah. <laughs> right. So she got an iPad. My daughter got iPad, Apple, Mac, you know, computer, iPhone, AirPods. Why she need all of those? I don't know. <laughs> See I don't my know, kids. Dog. I don't know. She you just, got an imagination. That's what you got. Go outside and use it. But you know, here's the crazy part. Sometimes now with the peer pressure, man, it's like you really gotta ground your kids because 
all these other kids got all these other things and they start feeling left out. Yeah. So yeah. you got to try to have a healthy balance to where you want your kids to be happy and have things, mm. but you also don't want them to be like, I don't want you to be no follower. Yeah. You can't just yeah. be just because they got that. That's and them. all of this technology, that's why all these kids have um, anxiety and depression and stuff. Yeah. Right? And it's because they're kind con- they're constantly wired. They can't have a second where they're not on a phone, on a watch, on an iPad, on a YouTube, on it. Yeah. Like they're constantly seeing other people live, thinking that that's their yeah. real life. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like that's yeah. not their real life. They don't live like that all the time. But you know, again, you know, that's why I feel like grandmas would have nipped all this <laughs> shit in the bud, but they gone. They ain't gone. Man, they gone. <laughs> they just they're just we a on our different. own. Like it's my, a grandma. Auntie, she, it's um, a grandma watching us. She ain't supposed to be yeah, watching this. Yeah. My auntie, yeah, her, sure. kid, her grandkids call her glamma. See? She don't like grandma. See, that's that bullshit. <laughs> Nigga, you glamma. Your grandma. See? That's bullshit. But I think right it's now. also different, too, because back in the day, even when you look at your parents, like I look at my parents' high school pictures, I'm like, y'all niggas was 37. Yeah, they did look older. Right? Yeah. So yeah. I think it was, it was kind of different. Like, your grandma back in the day was more, she wasn't really that old because they was having kids young as hell. Right. So they was always young, but they were just, but she behaved like the older. grandma, though. She behaved like a grandma. She was home. She, it was always a pie on the counter. Yeah. It always wasn't a, a lot pie. for her to do back in the day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it ain't a lot to do now. You can balance that shit. Nah, she going to be a friend. Grandma's There's just a lot on Facebook and YouTube. Right. They just don't want to be grandmas no <laughs> Mama more. Mama got to have a life, too. <laughs> I'm, sure, I'm sure grandma was getting dicked down back in the day. Wow. We just yeah. ain't know about yeah, it. Yeah. They kept that grandma. But also, a lot of them were still married. Right? right, and they wasn't working, so that was their life. And then now, a lot of people, grandma, like our generation, when we have kids, some of their grand grandparents, they're single moms. You know what I'm saying? So they still they still out in these streets a little bit. You know, they working, they got friends, they got they got a life outside of your kids. Man, I be performing, dude. We be at the comedy club. I'm sure you've seen this Keisha. It be a table full of grandma. I'm like, who the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Where the kids at? Right. What a great kid. You know kids. what they say? They be yeah. like, shit, I raised my kids. It's like, God. <laughs> <laughs> that too. It's like, yeah. like 12 grandmas at a table, nigga. Yeah. Just like out, <laughs> kicking it, nigga. They, they learn the game. Nigga, Hennessy, shots. <laughs> They like, learn the game. Who watching the babies? The they mamas. Like, yeah. like, that ain't none of my business. <laughs> like, yeah. Wow. They ain't doing that no more. I remember I had a suitcase that was like going to grandma's house. Y'all have yeah. a suitcase. Ain't no more grandma for the it weekend. Be like 10 of Shit. us over there at once. Grammy, like, you come over here. I ain't going to be here, though. <laughs> Y'all going to watch Bring each other. Bring your brother, cuz. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to the Usher concert. How That's a lot. <laughs> How you know about Usher? <laughs> These grandma, man. Usher. I, I miss good grandma, man. Yeah, miss grandma. Grandma was always home. Yeah, door always unlocked. <laughs> it was all yeah. I was about to say I don't think it's ever been a time once my grandma house she went there. You ain't got to call before you go. You were never hung- <laughs> you were never hungry. Never nah. hungry. As soon as you come in, you had to eat. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It was almost insulting for you to be like, "Nah, I'm good. You good? You right? <laughs> you try to eat. eat. You had an unlimited eat supply of food though. Because yeah. like ten more people stopped over here. My other cousins stopped. Still have food. Yeah. Still ate. Still have food. <laughs> Yeah, I got I got something for you. Hold on now. Right, yeah. Uh, Make I extra, warm, right. I warm up some of these ham hogs. Like, God, I ain't even hungry, though. <laughs> and you had to eat. Oh, it was rude. Yeah, yeah. She was offended. And if you bring your friend, your friend ain't eat. I don't like him. <laughs> I don't like that girl, baby. That ain't the one. <laughs> just cause, just cause Keisha ain't eat nothing. Nah, she ain't the one. Right. That's the devil's child. <laughs> cause she ain't eat. She ain't eat. I don't like her. <laughs> Man, Grandmas, man. they just, you know, they 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 found themselves. Yeah. They got they doing other things. Besides raising know. your kids. Maybe I'm being selfish. I just <laughs> I just miss the good old days when things were simpler. Grandmas was home and you could get something to eat. They'll wash your kids. They'll if you had a rip in your shirt, they'll sew it. Mm-hmm. These grandmas that. don't know how to sew. <laughs> nah. Hey, look, Keisha don't know how to sew shit. I, I, I could sew. I mean, you know, I could do a little something. I could fix you up if, but if you think I'm about to just make you a shirt, sew you together a whole prom dress, nah, that's not about to happen. You can't get the yarn and, and put the, a sweater together? That's not my ministry. <laughs> that's, just not, that's just not my ministry. Remember gardens? But I can cook you up a good meal. Grandma's had gardens. Remember gardens? Mm-hmm. Ain't no more gardens. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. Grow their own fruits and stuff. Ain't no more gardens. Ain't plant. no more that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, that's how, I, that's how I knew what Jeopardy and Price is Right was. Grandma house. Yeah. We used to play I Declare War at my grandma house. Yeah. Bob Barker. Go fish. <laughs> that's what I grew up on. Bob Barker, Price is Right. So my grandma was yeah. like, a, she's really into sports with my grandparents, so it was always the Pistons game or the Tigers game. Right. Is your or, grandma still here? No, she passed, she passed three years ago. So now you ain't got no yeah. more grandma. 
Nope. Or the uh, the uh, soap operas. Oh all yeah. My, all oh, my Days of Our Lives. Oh, I never, grew up on I All My Children. I grew I up on that. I never watched them because I never saw them over their house. Yeah, I mm. grew up on All My Children, dude. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. you had to go grandma house because there wasn't no babysitter. Grandma was babysitter. Right. Yeah. There wasn't yeah. no daycare. Yeah. In my grandma house, we just had to listen to Whitney Houston. My mom's mom. She passed when I was in high school. But I don't remember TV shows specifically that she watched. I don't know how always. daycares made money back then. Because <laughs> nobody went to daycare. Everybody went to grandma house. You know, and some people I was lucky. Know. I had, I had some people had great grandma, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, they had it real good. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Great grandma. I ain't never had great grandma. Yeah, you know, I did when fam- I was little. My family was I older. I think my great grandma passed. I was, I was real little though, maybe like three or four. Wow, yeah. great grandma. Like that's that's a young family. Yeah, but Man. I got cousins who like younger cousins who got great like grandma. Yeah. Like my grandma is some of my younger cousins' great great grandma, so. and she's still yo. Well, she passed alive. three years she ago. Passed but three. Yeah, yeah. she's still alive. Grandmas, man, that was good old days. We, <laughs> we miss grandmas. So all you grandmas out there, man, just try it. Like, try to be a grandma. Try. Get an apron. Eh? Just try it. Put it on. You know, they ain't this, got no more aprons. This is the world now where, you know what I mean? It's like everyone's trying to be younger than they actually are. Everyone. Mm. Yeah. Because social media, man, social media is ruining everything. It's ruining the world right now. Yeah, people be like, age ain't nothing but a thing. Yeah, but your knee still hurt. Right. So, so <laughs> your back still hurt. You know, so <laughs> your cholesterol still high. So you can say that shit if diabetes. you want. <laughs> yeah, you got diabetes. You can say it ain't nothing but a thing, but the yeah. Sugar. Yeah, your, sugar. Ass, your ass is breaking down. Oh, my God. As soon as it rains, your knee hurts. So. <laughs> <laughs> but don't just come for grandma's because what about granddaddy's too? Granddaddy's too, but you know, I always put more response because I don't expect no. Now y'all out here trying to hide. Granddaddy's been bullshit. Everybody <laughs> know granddaddy's been bullshit. Granddaddy's yeah. had a whole nother family on the side. Everybody <laughs> know that. Like, I never depended on a granddaddy. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, come on. It's a yeah, granddaddy. Talk to your grandma, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, granddaddies don't oh know shit. <laughs> granddaddy got to ask grandma what happened. What? Well, <laughs> going on? The granddaddy don't know shit. About the house stuff, about the bills and all that. Yeah. But granddaddy do. Granddaddy was always outside building some shit. He don't uh-huh. know what the fuck yeah. going on. Uh-huh. He don't know. Like, yep. He don't Anything know nothing. Anything your car, granddaddy know. Yeah. Granddaddy ain't the emotional dude you go to for shit. He don't know shit. Granddaddy's <laughs> like, you need to build a shelf. Fuck with me. <laughs> <laughs> but don't come talk to me about no emotional shit. Granddaddies <laughs> ain't had no emotions back then. Because yeah, they grew yeah. up from off that civil rights shit. Them motherfuckers mm-hmm. was tough. They, yep. they couldn't show emotion. They couldn't yeah. be soft. So they was just yeah. always building shit and providing. That was, yeah. grand, that's our granddaddy's move. You love me, nigga. You ate, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you yeah. got a roof over your head, right? right? Exactly. You got a roof over your head. I love you, nigga. My granddaddy's I ain't telling they love you, no shit like that. I remember that. my granddaddy had us beef, and he used to tell me, I thought just me, I was the prettiest girl in the world, right? right. And it didn't go to my head. It wasn't like a thing, but it was just like, and then one day I was over there, and my, we were in the den playing, seeing me and some of my little cousins, and my cousin Ashley was like, something, something, because I'm the prettiest girl in the world. And I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Man, we marched in that kitchen. We like seven deep. My grandma right. was just sitting there waiting. She was like, oh, I was waiting for this day. I'm like, granddaddy, <laughs> what you in? Come to find out, he didn't tell there, but like, all the girls, I got about 32 female cousins. All y'all the prettiest girl in the world. <laughs> and he gonna try and spin it. Like, well, you know, because y'all are my grandkid, because y'all are Lil's granddaughters, yeah. y'all. I'm like, oh, no, nah, granddaddy. Yeah. yeah. Hey, you granddaddy, man. First dude to lie to me was my granddaddy. <laughs> <laughs> it went down here from there. Wow. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's why your trust issue started. <laughs> wow. Man. Granddaddy. Mm-hmm. Them granddaddies were different, though. Yeah, they, they, man. They was them. They, but yeah, they was providers. Yeah. They didn't. Yeah. They was providers. The, the granddad yeah. that I know, um, he was my homeboy's granddad. He always had a Playboy magazine, and he would be done with it. He would give it to me <laughs> when he bust all, all the pages. I don't know. I just, I just know. I just know he come oh, from. He oh, come from. He come from somewhere, and then he'd be like, hey, hey, he hey, come hey, from hey. somewhere. The bathroom. He come from somewhere, and he'd be like, hey, yeah, yeah, damn. Right. And he was like, he was like a ninety-one year old man, and like he's like, you know, one of those one of those peppy white, I mean, uh, ninety uh, old older dudes that just kind of yeah. like got a lot of energy, kind of things. He was one of those dudes. So, you know, I'll, when I think about granddads, I just think about them like watching porn for some yeah, reason. My that's, grand, that's my my granddad. You know, my granddad had a whole family, like six blocks away. <laughs> Yeah. And we knew them. Yeah, like, we knew them. Like it was like it wasn't like no secret. Like I knew my auntie them was on the like the, and they I the middle school I went to they lived right across the street from me. So I yeah, oh, I, yeah, yeah. He'll he'll be over there. Then he'll be at my grandma's house. Then he'll be over there. Then he'll be at my grandma's house. 
<laughs> and him and my grandma stayed in separate rooms. Uh, wow. But yeah, that, I was yeah. like, damn, this nigga <laughs> doing this. <laughs> As I got older, I was like, damn, man. Yeah, we ain't doing that. We're not doing that no granddaddies. <laughs> Will, Will, Nigga, uh-uh, this real that. shit. My right. granddad had a whole nother side, a whole yeah. nother family. Yeah. Still married to my grandma, though. Doing it. And then wow. it was over there, and then, you know, just come back and forth. So that's why grandmas is the way they are now. They like, we ain't doing this shit no more. But grandma, my grandma was home, though. Yeah, but the <laughs> next generation was like, we not doing that. That's what we not going to do. We out in these streets. Hey. Pearl. Pearl. Beulah, where you at? But he held both houses down, though. Uh-huh. If you could do that, and, I mean. It, it gets worse, though. He was a deacon. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> ah. That was my granddaddy, man. Herman. 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 That, 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 that just sounds like the appropriate name. See, Herman just sounds like that old black, black man that was old some bullshit. Herman was a player. Hell no. <laughs> he a <laughs> Herman. Herman, man. Herman had him, boy. <laughs> Hell no. Right. So oh, that was man. my vision of grandparents. That's yeah. what I knew as grandparents. Because it was only one set. It was my mom, um, father and mom. So that's all I knew. So all I knew was grandma's was home, cook, mm-hmm. clean, da da da. My grandma ain't from when I came into the world, I don't think she was working anymore. So but mm-hmm. my grandma did work, you know. My mom's mom did she had thirteen kids, so it's like yeah, grandma, back, that was back the job. Back, so. That was the job. Grandma's yeah. but nothing. grandma's always had money. Always had yeah. money. They always had a stash. Mm-hmm. Like my grandma would always give me money, but don't tell me not to tell the, the other girl. Right, exactly. <laughs> don't tell them that I gave you. Yeah, yeah. Right. Like what? I, and I used to always think like, where you get all this money from? Like you don't work. Like you just be home <laughs> cooking. And you just got that, money. Like it's coming out but, of the bra. But my grandma was a hustler though, low key. She was the Avon lady. She used to do. Yeah. Um, she was very creative, and she had like these little statues and stuff that she had, and she was selling like. So you know they they. What's the Avon they lady? She sold Avon. What's Avon? It's like, it's like with the, perfume, the, um, yeah, lotion. Yeah, it's like cosmetic. Oh, okay, got yeah. it, got it, got it. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, had like yeah, a little yeah. catalog. And you yeah, just yeah, like, yeah, oh, got it, got it. Because now, what's the new, not Avon, but what's the, one, the pink one, Mary Kay. It's like, it, it was yeah. before Mary Kay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, Avon, that's when, that's old. That's like, <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that was my, I mean, I was just, you know, I miss grandmas, man. I Hopefully we could get back to those times. I actually get. really miss my grandma. I miss my oh. grandma. My, yeah, my grandma's tatted on my arm. So, yeah. mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. the day after she passed, I went and got the tattoo of my grandma. And yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was, it was like, it was not fun because she was like, <laughs> she was like, I can laugh now, but she was like dying for a minute. Like, it was like, come on, grandma, goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> it was a while. It took a long like, time. you going to go or not? Like, <laughs> <laughs> damn. damn. You nigga can't she keep driving up here. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, what the fuck, man? Because <laughs> it was hard. It, you know, like, I'm laughing like that, but it was hard to just see her like that. Yeah. Because as yeah, a kid, yeah. I always know my grandma to be vibrant, walking right, around, right, cooking. Right, yeah. And now she got all these tubes in her. And I, yeah. it was just like, Part of me was just like, yo, man, just, just go. Like, you yeah, know what I'm saying? So yeah. we would just start this shit. Yeah, yeah. And when it did happen, I was like, oh, no, fuck, come back. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. It was just one of those. It was just, you know, this grandma, man. Like, yeah, you know, that's yeah. the fabric of the family. Yeah. Right. That's how my grandma was. She had cancer. And, like, I could tell she was waiting for everybody to get there. Because she was asking, like, yeah, I ain't seen such and such. And then yeah. everybody came in. She's I like, came in. And four days after I left, my cousin came in as I was leaving and then she She, she threw passed. the deuces. Yeah. like, I'm out this bitch. But she left me her <laughs> necklace. I, oh, I normally always have it on. The necklace I have on with a cross. Uh. Yeah. But that's grandma's, man. Um, yeah. We miss grandma's, man. All you grandmas, grandma's out there, man, we fuck with y'all. We love y'all. And we just want y'all to, you know, be better. Be be- <laughs> <laughs> Do better, stop man. Stop going to Usher concerts, like, man. Yeah, stay man. Home. Stay on Facebook. Like, stop sending me friend requests. You my grandma. <laughs> I'm not... You don't want to see the shit I'm posting. And if right. you like it, that's going to be even more disturbing. <laughs> <laughs> right. The whole ain't shit like. So like <laughs> <laughs> what you thought your granddaddy Harry yeah, was? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Hell no. Hey, man. But yeah. shout out to all grandmas. Oh, shout out to all single women, period. Holding it down. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Y'all strong black women, white women, Hispanic women, Asian women, whatever, man. Shout out to all women Everybody doing their damn yeah. thing. We appreciate y'all, man. Uh, tune in next week for another episode. Episode of Nobody Asked Me. Get at me on my website, Malik As Comedy, uh, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Malik As Comedy. Appreciate y'all. Uh, Hess Wesley on Instagram, Grandma's DM me. <laughs> okay. Hey, Grandma's got that social security card. Hey, now, now you looking for Lady Eloise. <laughs> <laughs> y'all can find me on Instagram. It's Keisha.e. Appreciate y'all. Peace. Peace.